Hi, my name is Patrick Bookser. I'm the school principal at Jackson Academy of Math and Music. I'm in charge of making sure that school is a safe learning environment, kids are learning, teachers are teaching, and giving the opportunity for the community to really enjoy music at its best. The school's inception was developed around the concept of a math and music focus with also a K-8 approach. And so when, when the school kind of came together, we worked on our vision and some guiding principles that we believe in for teaching and learning. It's priceless to be able to give kids an opportunity to practice music, engage with it, learn about the historical connections to it, but more importantly, an outlet for their emotion and creativity. I'm Pam Hunter and I am the violin teacher for K and first grade at JAM. There's such an enthusiasm in each of their little hearts and they're so grateful for everything that I share with them. So I've learned a lot about just appreciating more about life through them. We're starting with kindergarten and first graders. It's the first time for most of them they've ever seen a violin, let alone held a violin. The Suzuki method allows us to introduce them to all the basic tenets of how to play how to have good posture, how to focus, how to hold the violin correctly, how to hold the bow correctly, how to use a rhythm, how to bow um, a rhythm without the real violin. So we use a practice violin and a practice bow so that by the time they get the real violin and the real bow, they will learn already, have already learned how to make a beautiful sound. They'll already be successful. Today they're going to learn for the first time how to hold the real bow. So this is a huge hurdle for them. I'm going to um, help them be familiar with that by bringing back the practice bow and let them hold that again and, and reassure them that holding the real bow is just the same. It's just, it's now it's a different object. 